Daniela Hanjkova, she came out and said that Raducanu uh, was losing uh, respect by her in the locker room uh, against her other players because of uh, the losses that she's taking, even though she's a US champion. Uh, you know, she's losing first rounds. Hanjkova came out and was a little bit critical of Emma Raducanu. And this is what Raducanu had to say in response to Hanchikova's comments after the second round loss the other day. All right, so this is what Raducanu said. She came back out and said that about the comments that were made by Hanchikova. She says, maybe you just see on the news or on social media me signing this or that deal. And I feel like it's quite misleading because I'm doing five to six hours a day of training. I'm at the club for 12 hours a day, but I throw out one post in a car on the way to practice. And all of a sudden it's, I don't focus on tennis. I think that it's a bit unfair, but it's something I have to learn to deal with. and become a bit more insensitive to the outside noise. I feel like my days with sponsors are pretty limited. I'm not doing crazy days. I'm doing three to four days every quarter, so it's not really that much. So there is, Arata kind of responding to the comments that Hanchikova made, and look, it makes sense, right? I mean, yeah, she's going to put on social media some of the sponsorship deals because, like I said, it's probably a part of her part of her deal. You know, Porsche probably sponsoring her and saying, hey, can you promote your social media because you've got a big following and a lot of people follow you. Or you're a very popular player. So it's probably part of her deal to put posts up on social media about the sponsors that she has because that's what sponsors are, right? It's about promotion so and marketing. So yeah, good to see Ryder kind of standing up for herself, coming out and saying, hey, you, see, you know, I don't do brand deals literally every day. I'm on the court. I'm, uh, tennis is my thing. And look, the results aren't coming through, and that isn't because she's not training. It's because she just doesn't know how to play WTA tennis week in, week out yet. She's learning on the job. She went from zero to hero uh, from winning the US Open, and now she's got to learn everything in reverse. But let me know in the chat. Let me know in the comments if you're watching this video later. Uh, what do you think? You think the criticism's fair on Raducanu, or do you think it's unfair? Uh, she thinks it's unfair. Some people would say, no, it is fair. She just, you know, she has to show us that she's training more.